Hey everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the monthly read for the month of October 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Aquarius. So, Aquarius, let's see what's coming through for you for the month of October time. Just be mindful, it's a general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. What is coming through for you, Aquarius? What is coming through for you in the month of October? Hold on. Let's pick the card up. So we do have the lovers. Let's see. With the devil. Let's see what else is coming through. I really feel like for majority of you, you will have options and love is what I see here. Uh, if you are dealing with someone specific, still, I do see that there will be somebody else as well coming in your life. Um, for those of you who are single, I really feel like you definitely are in that good space where you, you could have someone coming in your life um, through friends and family. I really feel like it's going to be more about your friends or something to do with that. Uh, but um, yeah, let's see more cards here. So I really feel like in for majority of you, you might meet someone through your friends um, or close connections. But I really feel like it's not coming with the family situation as what I see here. Let's see more here. What else is coming through? Um, I feel for majority of you right now, you are not happy with something. I, I think like it, you know, it's... Um, it can be, uh, you're not happy with something. It can be something to do with your work life. It can be something to do with your home life. But there is something which you are feeling like, you know, you really did not want this to happen. Uh, maybe it's in a relationship. Maybe it's in a, um, you know, a work environment. Maybe you were working towards something. You didn't get the outcome that you wanted. So there is some change that I see coming your way. But at the same time, um, the good thing that I see happening is, that you are gonna be um you are gonna be like having people in your life who you would be able to move on with uh you know situations will be happening such that you know you would not be able to stay stuck in a situation for long um you know even if there is a bad moment coming in for you in the month of october you would not be sticking on that uh because because there will be a lot coming next for you in your life so I, even if there is a breakup happening even if there is a sadness coming in your love life you would have you know uh, better days coming back in life so be that with the same person or with another person so you would not be like having the stagnation in your life in the month of october because i really feel like you know things are going to pace up you're going to feel like a lot is happening a lot is shifting so you would find it really hard to um, keep yourself balanced in that situation in a way where you would have a lot on your plate to be done, uh, to be dealt with, uh, to, de to deal with. And I really feel like, you know, it's going to be something which is going to be like definitely influencing you and your life. You would want to have some time with yourself, but you would not be getting that time for you. Um, I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, um, if you are dealing with someone specific and you know that they have been cheating on you or they have been like, you know, with another person, uh, maybe it's going to be the month where you are going to choose and decide that you don't want to be a part of this connection anymore. So for majority of you, yes. You know, if you have always been looking for, um, you know, uh, this the courage to, to move past this connection and to leave this connection because this person has been like, you know, dating other people as uh, well. Um, I really feel like, you know, you would have the courage enough to take stand for yourself and move away from this person. It would be a traumatic situation, but at the same time, you would have the courage enough to walk away from someone unhealthy. So you could be with someone who can provide you with a happy relationship. I really feel like, you know, for a majority of you, you know, what do you want and what you don't want? So I feel for some of you, maybe there, there is somebody in your life who is going to come, um, you know, who's going to step up, uh, in your life. Uh, tell you that how they feel for you, which is going to make things easier for you to step out of a um, unhealthy connection for for majority of you. But I really feel like you know you are going to be heading forward towards uh, 
a stable connection, a respectful relationship, an equal connection, which is going to happen for you in the month of October itself. You would have choices, you would have options. And I really feel like you know it is applicable to your all areas of your life. If you are walking away from a toxic environment, you would have other opportunities lying ahead for you in regards to your work life as well. So I really don't see that you are going to get stuck in any possible way in the month of October. You would have possibilities, opportunities right next are waiting for you so let's see what else is happening for you during the month of october what else is coming through what else is coming through in the month of october we do have the twin flames i really feel like you know for some of you you are going to be like um you know having a lot of um balance coming in your life um you would be wanting a relationship which is healthy and which is like you know where where the two of you complement each other where you two kind of like you know be there for each other at the same time even if you are too different from each other you still have that bond that is going to make you feel complete and whole and i really feel like you know for majority of you um you might be getting attracted to someone who is not your usual type uh in the month of october but whatever the case is going to be i really see you very happy and excited with that uh new connection coming in your life because you are ready to move on to something healthy. And if this person, even if they are so different from you, you are still going to have that bond with this person, which is going to make you feel like you are, you know, having a final secure relationship after a long period of time. So you're going to definitely ascend to a higher level of commitment coming in your love life in the month of October, leaving toxic people behind, choosing right people in your life. Um, I really feel like, you know, you might feel tempted, uh, temp you know, you might have been feeling manipulated by someone specific in your life lately, but now is the time when you are going to break yourself free from anybody who has been toxic in your life and um, you would be ready to um, take stand for yourself for sure in the month of October. So let's see what else is happening for you in the month of October. I feel like you know, it's not going to be an easy, easy decision for majority of you to break free from a person that you have been with or that you have been investing yourself in, but you would definitely be able to have that courage to move past the past and uh, you know change your perspective around um, maybe you thought that they will change so you stick around that person for long but then in the month of october it's not gonna work this way you are gonna choose to be with someone who is loyal who is faithful who is genuine with you from day one you don't care if they are like you or not what you care about is they should have the same respect towards you as you have for them. So um, your perceptions and perspectives are changing in the month of October and you can experience that a lot. A win-win outcome uh, is forecast and the prosperity lies ahead. For some of you, you could be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus, but yes, I really feel like you know the month of uh, October is going to be the month where um, you know, you're not going to be like trying to fix someone's life to, to get an outcome that you want. Uh, you would rather choose to be with someone who whose life is already fixed and you really want to be come an add-on to their life and they want to become an add-on to your life regardless of like you know whatever you are doing in your personal individual lives uh, you would want to come together to have a relationship built on um, mutual respect and I really feel like you know, that's exactly what I see coming through for you in the month of October for you so yeah that's what I see um, for you guys in the month of October if it was of help don't forget to like, share and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.